Hello again, everybody, and welcome back to Fujit Splits with me, Fujit. Hello. So, in this video, I want to talk about what I consider to be one of the best tanks, if not the best heavy tank in Tier 8. That's right, the Tiger II. Now, not only does the tank look sexy, but it has pretty decent clothing as well, what with that legendary camo. But it's not just that. I mean, this tank was tinkered with a few updates back, and you know what? This thing is just a beast. I mean, this is by far one of the best heavy tanks I think you can get in Tier 8. Okay, it may not have the best DPM, but it's got certainly really trolly armor. I mean, forget your premium tanks like the Object 252U and, and stuff like that. I mean, this thing has just got everything going for it. It is a heavy, but it's not that slow. It's actually quite quick off the mark. As I said, it's got trolly armor. It's got a fantastic gun that dishes out some pretty decent penetration in a pretty decent amount of time. And it's got a really good aim time. It's also incredibly noob friendly. Now, there are other heavies in Tier 8. I get that, I understand that. For example, I particularly like the Yo, the Tier 8 Yo. I mean, I think that tank is a bit of a beastie as well, which is also a tech tree. But for me, it's the Tiger 2 that really seals the deal. The reason being, the Yo is good, don't get me wrong. I, I love that tank, but it's a clipper and you know, if you're not used to clippers, you can get pretty stuck on it. It does have trolley armor. It is a little bit slow off the mark, to be fair. I mean, it is a bit of a lumbering hunk of American metal. Whereas the Tiger has a lot more pros than cons. As I said, it hasn't got the best DPM. I totally agree with you there. It hasn't got, you know, everything going for it. But what it does have is everything balanced in the right direction. And with everything being balanced in the right direction, it really allows you, even if you're a new player, to start getting used to playing these bigger, heavier type tanks. And that's why I love the Tiger too, because you really can roll out in this thing and be pretty, pretty, secure in the knowledge that unless you are a complete potato you're gonna do relatively well in the damn thing because it is that good now i don't set any world records here in this game mainly because i'm tuning with ethelump and he is far 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 too op but we do pretty well i mean we do 2.3k and i find with the tiger you should be averaging around you know, one and a half, it, 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 close to the 2k mark, if I'm being honest. You really should be hitting around the 2k damage mark if you're playing it effectively. Because the gun is just fantastic. Now, as I said, I mean, I could sit here and go through each and every stat, compare it to every other tank, and bestow each and every virtue of this tank. But you don't really need to know that, to be honest with you. What you need to know is that it's strong, it's a beast, and it's got a fantastic gun. And you can drive it relatively aggressively. It does, and it can, get hurt. Of course it can. But look at the reload on this thing. Okay, I've dropped the adrenaline. But we, we're already up to killing two tanks. We've only done 700 damage, but we've all... And look at that for accuracy on the gun. And I love this tank. It really is a beautiful, beautiful tank to get to grips with. And believe me, the more you roll out in it, the more you will get comfortable with it. And once you're comfortable with it, you will start really shining in this thing. And you will love it. I mean, I know I do. And that's the thing. And like I said, I'm not gonna go for each and every stat. You don't need to know each and every stat. You just need to know the tank's a bloody good tank. It's a bit of a beast. It's noob friendly and and you can have fun with it. Now, in a minute, I want to know where this shot actually goes because if you watch, it's a ghost shot. So I said you should be doing 2K. You should. Watch this on the Borsig. Straight through him. 
That is a ghost shot. I want to show you that again. So I really want to know where that went. And if you know, send answers on a postcard to that's a ghost shot care of me because I mean it, it's things like that that really upset me because that would have been a good game but we don't do our 2k because we have a ghost shot that's not the point though I mean the fact of the matter is it's still a bloody good tank and I love it and I really love it and I think everybody should have a Tiger 2 in their garage with the legendary camo and they should be rolling out and smacking everybody anyway I've been fruited been my take on the Tiger 2, a tank everybody should have in their garage because it's just truly fantastic. By all means, comment and like below. And until the next time, guys, stay safe out there, have fun on the battlefield, and happy tanking because that is what it's all about having fun and being happy. Go shells, notwithstanding. <laughs>